Hello, Cody here with 3D Infotech, and today I'll demonstrate how to add macro scripts to your inspection sequence. In my example, I have finished inspecting my first piece, and I'm ready to create the next. I'd like to add a simple macro I've written, which exports the piece's report as a PDF file and saves the project. Whenever a new piece is created, you have the option to launch the Play Inspection tool. Using Play Inspection automatically steps through the inspection process, leaving the user to do only manual steps, such as scanning, probing, and creating point pairs. So when I make a new piece for this project, I just bring in a new scan file, and the rest is done automatically. However, you'll notice that while my report was generated, it was not exported. Let's change that. The sequence that Play Inspection steps through is automatically generated, but you have the ability to change and add to the sequence using the Sequence Editor, found here. Clicking on the leftmost icon in the toolbar creates a new sequence, and copies the auto-generated sequence. The Sequence Editor allows you to reorder, remove, or add steps in the automatic inspection. For this video, I want to add a macro into the sequence. Under the plus icon, I can add a wide variety of steps. The bottom most icon is for adding macro scripts. Once I create a step in the sequence for a macro, I have the option of creating a new one or finding the file for a macro I've already written. In this case, I'll choose the latter. Now that I've loaded the macro into the sequence, I'm done. I'll create a new piece to make sure it works. As you can see, my PDF was exported. Thank you for watching.